if you haven't never used auto drive I'll start from the beginning and kind of give you guys a quick tutorial that at least I could have a video going until I get my tutorial made maybe I can do it on this one um, so what you would need to do let me why is it not driving oh yeah you have to have fertilizer in there if you want to use course play and I need soybeans for this one <laughs> yep uh, let me uh, let me show you how to start from scratch with auto drive so let me let's just pause this game Let's go to my desktop. Come on. So what you want to do is you want to start a start up on your game save, which I have one already here, all ready to show you guys how to do this. All right, so that problem I can solve really quick for you. Let me get you the link here. Because that's, you need the newest update to get that. So, um, what you need to do is go to this website, go all the way down to the bottom of the page where it says latest release candidate 1.0.5. And it will work because you're probably using 1.1.0.4 welcome Marinda just came from your stream oh you're still are you still streaming yet cool all right so what you want to do is start your game which I have one here So just make sure auto drives enabled, which it is, and you got 1.1.0.5. Hit start. Well, if you're using 1.1.0.5, Five, it should be RC5. <laughs> Not four, if that's what you meant. Welcome, Cowboy Mikes. Thank you for the host. Hey. Oh, hi. Welcome back. All right, so we're loading. Well, point 0.5 is not RC4, it's point 0.4 RC. Oh no, maybe it's point... Oh, you're one behind. I gotcha. But as long as it's point 0.5, it works. And that could be the reason why, boom, yours works and... Um, JD's works, because they got RC5, or 4. It's still point 0.5, but it's RC... You know, it's, yeah, I got it. All right, so what you want to do is you want to save once you have auto drive enabled. And you want to just make sure you have auto drive enabled by going in your vehicle. Left alt and on your number pad hit zero and you can see the menu comes off and on so that you know it's enabled and works. So then what you want to do then is you want to go out of the game after you saved it. So we'll go back out. OK, 
Okay, so then we want to go to game save eight. Let's go to my documents, my games, Farming Simulator 19, game save eight. All right, so you'll see here, you, this is the config file that you want to replace. So what I'll do is I'll just delete it. So I'll delete it, then I'll go to the PV Mods website, go into Mods, and you'll go down there until you find Auto Drive Routes for PV County 16X. Click on that. And you want to hit Download. And then what I'll do is, is I'm going to send that. To me, this is the easiest way that I do is I got a folder with for mods so what I'll do is I'll delete that one out because I already have it there and so I'll put it in my downloads folder yes and what I want to do is let's shrink this up let's pull up another one of the download file there right there and what I'll do is I'll take that and just drop it into the game save and there it is so all you have to do so now what we'll do is we'll go back into that game save. Farming Simulator 19. Hey, Mem, how you doing? Nanik, thank you for the party of three, for the raid. Who else did I miss while I was doing this? Um, Honda Teddy, hello, how you doing? All right, so you want to go? Man. Thank you for the follow, Evans347, and welcome to my stream. So what you want to do is you want to go in the back into your game save eight. Since you already had auto drive clicked the last time, you don't have to click it again. Wait for it to load. Blame me. <laughs> Almost did it. So always waiting. The biggest thing is you got to make sure that you have auto drive enabled and you have the. Hello, IT. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Oh, uh, who's that? Uh, Don, be here. Welcome. Um, make sure you have the latest release candidate for auto drive. And blame auto drive. <laughs> No, you don't have to switch. All you have to do is in your game save is right here. This is game save eight. All you have to do is just download. Yeah, about time you came in there, Nyanik. <laughs> no, um, the auto drive Pleasant Valley. Could All right, let's go back. You want to make sure just replace the config file that's in this game save. That's all you have to do from what you download my routes. You have to make sure it's after you save the game with auto drive enabled, you find the file which I got right here. This one's got to get replaced with the one from the website. And then you'll have my routes in game. And then I'll show you right here. Thank you for the follow, Slow10,000. Welcome to my stream. All right, so let's get into a vehicle. So right now, then, when you click on this, you'll see that you have all my routes in here. You know when you got them right is when you see all these. This is the one right off the website. So... If you want to make a route, well, since we're here, we'll do that here on this one. Because you can add to routes all over this map and connect them to the ones I already made for you. So what you want to do is you want to click on the edit mode, which is the triangle sign in the right corner. 
and that'll pull up you can see the roads see I didn't have anything for Johnson farm which is good because then then I could show you how to do this oh you're welcome there but ass 2010 I'm glad that it worked all right so what I want to do is if I wanted to make a route that goes to Johnson farm what I'll do is see the red line there I want to make sure it's pointing in the direction I want to yeah on a server unless you're admit you don't make routes make sure you talk to the guy in charge of your server before you use auto drive <laughs> otherwise you will have problems all right so you want to do is for this one you want to left click and you'll get a green arrow you just want to go and make a route like this and what I'll do is I'll stop right here and what I'll do is I'll make a stop a target they call it we'll name it Johnson Farm create and then I'm gonna drive it we'll drive it all the way around here because then what I'll do is I'll make a salo one two for you guys hey wheels hey John how you doing cowboy mics with the rooster <clears throat> just remember when you're making routes like this um, kind of picture a combine if you want to take it down there and you don't get too close to a building otherwise the combine ain't gonna go anywhere so here's where you want to do when you want to want to connect is you want to left control left mouse click mouse button here see how it turned it yellow instead of orange and then you want to go over here where see where it's blue and just click and now we're connected to the route there so now what I'll do is I'll turn off record and I'll back up I'll do the same make sure you get that red line the direction you want it to go hit record and you want to go over to the yellow line that's going this direction do the same thing left control left mouse button turn it yellow and then click and now you're connected yep I will do that in a second here so then what you want to do here is I'm gonna go through the sallow here because then I can show you what Manolin is talking about so you want to start record again so what I'll do is I'll go this way into the sallow now what I'll do is I'll do what a commonly mistake most people including myself have made is I'll make the target right here so John so Johnson farm sallow that's solo <laughs> sallow now what I'll do is I'll go up here and what we'll do is do the same thing as I'll go this direction first left left mouse button click left again turn off record uh, cowboy mics you can